Compute the electric potential of three charges at the origin in the following configuration. And you can see we have a positive charge here, Q1, eight units away from the origin. Q2 is two units, and Q3 is six. Notice I didn't talk about X being at negative 8.00 meters. We just care about the distance, not the sign. The only place we worry about the sign is in the sign of the charge. Other than that, we want to know the magnitude of the distance between the charge and the place where we want to compute the electric potential. Once we find the potential due to each charge right here at the origin, we just add them up. So we bring it out here, and you can see this is the voltage due to charge 1. We put charge 1 over here, 5 times 10 to the minus 9th coulombs. It is 8 meters away. Even though it's to the left, we really don't care here. The important part is the sign of the charge. The second potential, V2 at the origin, well, that's 2 meters away. And that, again, has a positive charge. So in both these cases, we get a positive voltage. When we go to charge 3, the voltage there, we have a negative charge. So we have a negative voltage, negative 13.5. And then we just algebraically sum them up. 5.63 plus 13.5 minus 13.5 and we have a voltage at the origin due to the three charges at 5.63 volts.